Hi, I'm meteorologist Carl Galley, and thanks for joining me for Stormwatch. I'm watching a stationary front lying across the Red River Valley between Oklahoma and Texas here on Monday. And that's going to be the focusing mechanism for some wet weather, especially to the north, because moist flow out of the Gulf is going to be overrunning this stationary boundary and producing a lot of wet weather, mainly across Kansas, northern Oklahoma, up to southern Nebraska, and over towards Missouri. Now, not out of the question that one or two of these show uh, thunderstorms could turn severe with some gusty winds and some small hail, but overall, it's just going to be a lot of wet weather as we start out the new work week. Now, Tuesday, going to watch a wave of low pressure moving along that front. That's going to enhance our shower and thunderstorm chances across eastern Kansas over into Missouri, and wet weather gradually spreading eastward into southern Illinois as well. And as we track that storm system here into the south through midweek, we're going to see some wet weather returning to some places that get a, br a brief chance to dry out early in the week. So our wave of low pressure continues eastward. Tuesday, the wet weather spreads into the Ohio Valley as far east as Louisville and Lexington, Kentucky. And then midweek on Wednesday, here we go. More wet weather for the south. Cities like Atlanta, Charlotte, Charleston, and Nashville. You're back into the shower and thunderstorm activity midweek on Wednesday. And as that wave of low pressure continues eastward Thursday, more unsettled weather for the southeast with showers and storms.